Hi, this is lesson 2.9. Number, beating a picture of 10,000. What number does one of these blocks represent? And how do you know? So we can see we have this cubes of 1,000. So how many numbers are there? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that is like a measurement of one meter long. One meter long. So we can see the 10,000. So that means we have one 10,000. Then we have 10,000, like we counted here. Each cube is a thousand. We have 10,000. So we have 10,000, which is the same as one ten thousands. We can also represent it to be one hundred. One hundred. Hundreds, one hundred hundreds. It can also be depicted to be one thousand tens, and this number can also be represented by ten thousand ones. Ten thousand ones. Now let's go on to the workout. Look at the abacus. Write the matching number on the expander. This is the abacus and this is the expander. So we have 10,000, 1,000, 100, tenths and ones. So three, we have three bits here. So that means Three ten thousands. We have seven bits here. That is seven thousands. We have four bits here. That is four hundreds. We have five bits here. That is five tenths. And we have two bits, which is two tenths. Two ones. I beg your pardon. Part B. So we have how many bits on the ten thousand? We have seven bits for the 10,000. For the thousand, we have one bit. For the hundreds, we have three bits. For the tens, we have two tens. And for the ones bit, we have nine bits. Now let's go to number two. Draw bits or write numbers to complete the missing part. So here we have six ten thousands. We write it here. Four thousands. Five hundreds. Two tens. And eight ones. And here we're going to draw, so two ten thousands, we will draw two bits, six thousands, one, two, three, four, five, six, two hundreds, one, two, seven tens, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, four ones, one, Two, three, four. Part C. 
five ten thousand so we'll draw five bits one two three four five two thousands one two seven hundreds one two three four five six seven three tens one two three six ones one two three four five six part d we have four ten thousands six thousands eight hundreds two tens and five ones part e Part A, we have one ten thousand. So we draw one bit. Nine thousands. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Four hundred, two, three, four. One tenth. Eight once. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and part F. We have eight ten thousand, five thousands, one hundred, seven tenths and two ones. Now let's go to the first finisher. Imagine you had only hundreds, tenths and ones block write how you could represent this number. You could use 752 hundreds block. Five, ten blocks, and three ones, blocks. Now let's go on to the practice, 2.9. Number one, look at the abacus. Write the matching number on the expander. For part A, so we have four ten thousands, two thousands, six hundred, three tenths, and seven ones. Part B, we have four ten thousands, eight thousands. 500, 6 tenths, and 1 ones. Now for number two, draw bits or write numbers to complete the missing parts. So for part A, we have 6 ten thousands, so we're going to write 6 here. 3 thousands, 7 hundreds, eight tenths, and five ones. For part B, four bits here, two bits, seven bits in the hundreds, three 
three beads in the tens and one bead here. Part C, eight beads here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One bead in the thousands, three beads in the hundreds, three. Two beads here, one, two, five here, one, two, three, four, five. And for part D, we have six, ten thousands, we have five thousands, five hundreds, nine tenths, and three ones. Part F, we draw two bits, six. Five bits. One bit, seven bits here. Three, four, five, six, seven. And for part F, we have two ten thousands, nine thousands, three hundred, eight tens, four ones. Compare your answer with mine and do the necessary corrections.